When your Xbox 360 wired controller won't turn on, start by ensuring your console has a stable power connection. A powered off or unstable console cannot provide power to wired controllers. Next, check the USB ports on your Xbox 360. Faulty or dirty USB ports are the most common cause of controller connection issues. Try different USB ports on your console to isolate the problem. Clean the USB ports using compressed air to remove dust and debris. Accumulated dirt can prevent proper electrical contact between the controller and console. Carefully inspect your controller's USB cable for any visible damage. Look for cuts, fraying, bends, or exposed wires that could interrupt the connection. If possible, test with a different USB cable to rule out cable-related issues. This helps determine whether the problem is with the cable or the controller itself. Restart your Xbox 360 console to resolve potential software glitches. Many connection issues are caused by temporary software problems that a simple restart can fix. Press the Xbox button on both the controller and console simultaneously to resync the connection. This reestablishes the communication link between devices. For a hard reset, hold the Xbox button on the controller for 10 seconds. This completely resets the controller's internal state and can resolve persistent connection issues. These troubleshooting steps address the most common causes of Xbox 360 controller connection issues, faulty USB ports, damaged cables, and software glitches. Try each step systematically to identify and resolve the problem.